everybody, I'm Janelle. I love seeing your bright, smiling faces. Do you know what time it is? It's time for worship. This is the time when we can show God we love Him and tell Him thank you for all He's done. Let's stand up and sing out our song for this month, Attitude of Gratitude. always easy to be grateful when I'm sad, but when I'm singing, I see that it's not so bad. We can thank God for everything He's done for us. Who can you thank for everything? I can thank God for everything. That's right! I can thank God for everything. The Bible teaches us that I will give thanks to the Lord with my whole heart. Psalm 111 verse 1. Let's say that together. I will give thanks to the Lord with my whole heart. Psalm 111, verse 1. Because I know that God loves me, I just want to say thank you, God. Let's sing that together. I want to clap my hands. I want to jump and dance. I'm going to shout and sing. Thank you, God, for everything. I want to clap my hands. Shout and sing, thank you God for everything Thank you, thank you, thank you God For everything you've done for me I just wanna shout and sing Thank you, thank you, thank you God For everything you've done for me I just wanna shout and sing Jump and dance I'm gonna shout and sing Thank you God for everything I wanna clap my hands I wanna jump and dance I'm gonna shout and sing Thank you God for everything Thank you, thank you, thank you God For everything you've done for me I just wanna shout and sing Thank you, thank you, thank you God For everything you've done for me Shout and sing. Oh, 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 thank you. Oh, 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 thank you. Oh, 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 thank you. Thank you, God. It makes me wanna, wanna, 
That's such a good reminder. I just want to shout and sing and say thank you, God, for everything. So one more time, who can you thank for everything? I can thank God for everything. That's right, friends. Thanks for worshiping with me today. All right, let's find out what our Bible story has for us today. Take a look at this. Who? Who? Know what time it is? It's time to hear a story full of wonder. There's so much fun we'll have learning together. So let's go down, go down to the clubhouse with Ollie and his friends. Let's go down, down, down to the clubhouse where wonder never ends at the Wonder Clubhouse. We miss you at the Wonder Clubhouse. We miss you. Hi, friends. I'm Zoe, and I just came back from this super fun party. <laughs> My family and everyone who helped with the community garden this year had a big dinner. We all made something to share using the food from our garden. And while we ate, we talked about how thankful we are for everyone who helped. Like my neighbor, who made all the lists to help us know what to plant. Like my neighbor, Mr. Mark. He had all kinds of gardening tools and he even helped us learn how to use some. And everyone who helped take care of the garden and picked the food. Wow, so many people helped with the community garden. Who? Who? It's Ollie! Hello, Zoe. Who? Who? Thinking of those who helped, are you? Oh, hi, Ollie. I was just thinking about how many people helped with the garden. Getting help is wonderful. It's true. I know someone who helped, too. Listen to this story. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. And I can't forget the carrots. <laughs> wow. Oh, hey, friends. I'm Luis. Look at this. I'm putting together this basket of vegetables to give to my good friend, Mark. He really helped me out when I was planting my garden this year. I couldn't have done it without him. <laughs> oh, that makes me think of a story. Do you want to help me build it? Ha <laughs> ha, great. Let's put it on the store fence. Hammers up, little builders! Ready? Uno, dos, tres, hammer! Great job! You can put your hammers down. Now, we just need our story tools. There we go. Today's true story begins in this town. And this is Elisha. Elisha was God's friend and traveled to this town to do God's work. One day, he met a woman who wanted to help him. She thought he might be hungry, so she invited him to dinner with her and her husband. Elisha was thankful for the help, and he ate dinner with them. Then, whenever Elisha was in town, he ate dinner at their house. Whoop, here he comes. <laughs> Time to eat. There he goes! <laughs> oh, oh, <laughs> time to eat again! And he's off! <laughs> Thank you! <laughs> One day, they had an idea of how they could help Elisha even more. The woman and her husband decided to build a room on the roof of their house for Elisha. Now they have the room, but what are they gonna put in it? Elisha will need to sleep on something. What should it be? Should he sleep on a trampoline? Or should he sleep on a bed? <laughs> a bed, that's right. Now, what if Elisha needs a place to sit and write a letter? What will he need? A swimming pool? 
or a table and chair? <laughs> a table and chair, you're right. That's exactly what he'll need. Now, one last thing. Elisha will need something to help him see in his room when it gets dark. What will he need for that? A kangaroo or a lamp? <laughs> a lamp, you're right. That's exactly what he'll need. The woman made sure Elisha's room was all ready for him. There was a bed so he could sleep, there was a table and chair so he could write, and there was a lamp to help him see in the dark. When Elisha saw the room, he was so happy and thankful. The woman and her husband were such great helpers. Elisha was very thankful that God had given him people to help him. <laughs> hey there, Ollie. Tell me, who can you thank for everything? I can thank God for everything. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who can you thank for everything? I can thank God for everything. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Adios. So there's your story, and it's all true. The woman helped Elisha. And we have people who help us, too. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Hoo! Hoo! Wow. Elisha was so thankful that God gave him people to help him. I can thank God for the people that helped me. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say, got it. Get it? Got it! Good! Wow, I'm so thankful for everyone who helps with the garden. I'm going to go sit and thank God for them right now. See you next time. When Elisha saw the room, he was so happy and thankful. The woman and her husband were such great helpers. Elisha was very thankful that God had given him people to help him. Isn't that awesome? And can we thank God for the people who help us too? Who helps you? Maybe your mom or dad or teachers or your grandparents? So many people help us and we can thank God for them. Who can you thank for everything? I can thank God for everything. Again, who can you thank for everything? I can thank God for everything. You got it. Okay friends, it's time to pray. Let's close our eyes and talk to God together. God. We love you so much. Thank you for the people that helped Elisha. And thank you for the people who help us too. We love you so much. In Jesus' name, amen. You did an awesome job listening today. Parents, don't forget to follow us on Instagram at SVKids and subscribe to our YouTube channel, Sun Valley Kids. I'll see you next time. Bye.